Yeah, I remember uh, one day my sister was crying because some kids told her she had to go sit with the other colored girls at lunch. As a teenager, I had my most extreme experience with prejudice when my parents threw me out for being gay and I was homeless. I made it my life's work to understand and reduce the injustice, human suffering, and disparities that arise from prejudice and inequity. And it was important that I used a scientific approach because research shows that non-scientific approaches do not work and often make things worse. Over the last 13 years, drawing on decades of scientific research, my colleagues and I developed the first, and thus far the only, training program experimentally shown to create long-lasting, meaningful change. It empowers people with practical tools to identify and correct biases and inequities in themselves and in social systems. For years after the training, people are powerful agents of change who take action to reduce bias and inequity. Organizations have more positive, inclusive climates, and even hire more members of underrepresented groups. We want to put more people like that out in the world, scaling up this evidence-based model of change through mass dissemination and outreach. By creating a cultural movement that empowers people as agents of change, we can make a difference and address inequity now. Behavioral science provides a blueprint to create a better world for our future generations. Let's build it.